Hey, everybody. Guess Hi. what? Guess what we're doing, Amanda? We're getting ready for season four. Season four, y'all. Can oh, you believe it? No. We're just cruising. We're popping these out like uh, like babies. I don't know. <laughs> little podcast babies. They are a little podcast babies. You know what? Whenever somebody says babies, I automatically think of those baby clamshells. Is that in Fantasia? Very strange. I know. I don't. I don't. I don't know that reference. <laughs> it's very strange. Talking, they're like clams and they have little pacifiers. Oh, And it's wow. like the bonnets. That is very strange. I know. That's what you think of. Not your own baby. No, not actual physical You think children. of clam babies from Fantasia. You think of clam babies. You have a very eccentric mind. I love it. <laughs> I love it. And that's sure why we're what here. what it says about me. <laughs> well, uh, everybody, we want you to know that season four comes out next week. And that it will, it's going to be a really great season. We're already so excited. We already know we have a great lineup. Um, it's so good. Yeah. And last week we did a, a, a little... We did our own version yeah. of the questions. Which I feel like is our hardest series of questions. Yes. It is. You did it. You drew up it's these questions. It's my own fault. Amanda drew up all the questions for season four. I was like, I'm exhausted from thinking about these. Do you have any? I can't think of anything new. And you came up with so many. And I, I like <laughs> edited them out a little bit, trying to pick like the most kind of conversational ones that I thought weren't that difficult, but they are difficult. They are. Yeah. When we put ourselves on the spot, it was like, oh, wait, maybe we should have thought this. They're thinker. Like, These are thinker questions. We have to make sure to get them to people ahead of time this time. Yes, we have to make sure people know them ahead of time. We probably will forget, but maybe we can help them out a little. But um, yeah, guys, check that out. Last week's episode was really fun um, where we just talk about the questions and the this or that, which I always love the this or that. And then we have next week, you guys, we have... Probably my favorite guest, if I can say that. You think so? Yeah. I just, I adore this woman and I want to be her so badly. I know, me too. It's Rita Moreno, guys. Oh. I mean, she is iconic, 90-year-old, spectacular. And if Does you get a chance- Does not stop. Oh my gosh, this woman is, I. she is going to outlive me. And she's twice my age. And she walks on heels for eight hours. And we did a movie together. She was like literally on heels for eight hours during the day. She came in our podcast studio, which I, I don't know a lot of 90 year olds that no. that get out of bed. No, she I don't know any 90 year olds. Let's I be think honest. she might have more energy than me. <laughs> oh, she definitely does. She has more brain power. Her eyesight is better than mine. I think and her she hearing can eat is me better. under a table. Yeah, she's uh, she's got some healthy ways about her. But and I'm going to pick her brain about all of them. But I am I'm I've been working with this woman for the last month and she is fascinating and just Incredible. And I'm I, convinced she's Evelyn Hugo. She's Evelyn Hugo from the Seven Husbands we of Evelyn Hugo. We need to text her and find out. Oh, we did. We gave her the book, so we'll have to, we'll find out if she. Little um, hint, hint, what's yeah, to come. I, I really think she is Evelyn Hugo. I mean, she's just a powerhouse, incredible, legendary. If you don't know who she is, look her up briefly, but you really don't have to because next week we will cover it all on the podcast. We have also got Taylor Spratler, who is my co-star on Melissa and Joey. So we will watch, well, we will talk about an episode, the pilot of Melissa and Joey, if you guys want to get ahead on that and uh, watch that episode. We've also got our friend Candace King coming back again. Yes, We talk about so many fun things with her, right? We're going to cover, she's got a new podcast, so we're going to cover that um, and just see what she's been doing since yes. the beginning of the year when she was our first guest. Just wild. What else do we have? We have, oh, we're going to do a, a very Halloween um, episode. Oh, yes. Sabrina. That one. We're going to watch an episode, right? <laughs> yeah. Should we yeah, tell we people are. what episode so they can get ahead of Oh, yeah. Too? Pancake Madness. Madness. My favorite episode, Pancake Madness. I see why it is your favorite, but we'll it's, save that conversation. It's season three, episode five, I believe. So mm -hmm. check that out um, if you want to get ahead. That one's going to be uh, late October. We'll do that right before Halloween. And then we'll visit with one of your co-stars from Sabrina. Yep. yep. We've got... Uh, we got Marissa Jarrett Winoker. Oh, she's... Broadway star. Fabulous. Just, you know her from lots of lots of little things. Lots We've, of... Uh, tons of stuff. Revisiting the musical world. Yes. With Mark Martell and his wife. Mark Martell, yeah, who is a, does a queen cover band that's very notorious. Um, we have uh, Emily Kinney. Her and Rita are the leading ladies of my movie, Santa Boot Camp. So I was lucky enough to get her and Marissa. Jarrett Winokur is also in the movie. So dragged them in here. Spring hung out with them for a little while. Yeah, we've got so we've got a great um, group of people coming in the next few weeks for you guys. So check it out. Tell your friends. Subscribe. We uh, we could use your guys' help to, uh, you know, just rate and review. I would like to post the reviews on the stories of mm -hmm. What Women Binge page. You can check out the What Women Binge Instagram because on there we do, like, reviews of things that we're watching, listening to. Oh, and we have some reading. great ones coming up. We've been in the television. I've been not only reading, but now I've, like, 
revisited some like music. Well, you read like a book a day. It's insane. I can't even be in a book club with you and Angela Lanter because you guys <laughs> read so much. I'm like, I'm, I'm one book and you're like eight right now. ahead. I'm behind right now because I got sucked into a new one. Well, I noticed it took you a little while in the Paris apartment. Did that take you a while? Well, because I just haven't had as much. Time. I just saw some pictures on Instagram of you carrying it around. I was like, yeah. she's still working. Because usually you're like one flight and you'd be like through I that. I know, but I, I slept a lot. On oh, those flights. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody took a trip to LA and had too much fun. Right. We'll talk about that too. I have stories to tell. I can't wait. I haven't heard them yet. <laughs> well, season four, it feels weird to have like delayed things and like keep you guys on hold, but the season is just so good and we felt like it needed its own release. Yes. It needed a moment. It needed a, a moment to clear some space for it and to bring you guys some great guests and have some fun. We have just so much fun together here, right? In our cute little podcast studio. So check us out on YouTube. You can check us out on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, anywhere you get podcasts. All you have to do is scroll down and then you hit the little five stars and we would really appreciate that. Then you can leave a little review. And please share our YouTube channel. Yeah. We we love making these videos for you guys. We love spending our time here together and yeah. showing off. We're well lit, you guys. We Those are. that only listen to it. We are flawless. We are so well lit in here. You can't see. This is the best I'm going to look, so check it out while you can. <laughs> but we would really appreciate you subscribing there and sharing with your friends. Yeah, and Facebook, too, right? We're on my yes. Facebook if page. if you want to watch every release day Wednesday at 2 Central, we are live on Facebook. It's fun. That's 3 p.m. Eastern, um, noon Pacific. Thank you. <laughs> Did I do that math right? Sometimes I, I never sure. know where I am, and I get I get very My confused. weather brain should be like, yeah. And I'm like, mm, <laughs> Something like that. It's an hour this way six. and two hours that way. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you guys, check it out, and um, thank you so much for being here. And again, just spread the word, y'all. Thank you guys for joining us here at What Women Binge. Can you do us a favor and give us an Apple podcast review? It helps a lot. Yeah, and while you're at it, you can follow What Women Binge on Instagram. And follow me on Instagram, at Amanda WWB. If you like listening to the podcast, you would love seeing it. So you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Melissa Joan Hart Official for full episodes, bonus content, and so much more. What Women Binge is produced by Laughagram Studios. Our wonderful theme song was written and produced by my cute husband, Mark Wilkerson. Video production by Matt Giesler and Jay Hawley. Audio by Matt Lott. Production assistant, Jen Best. And she is the best. What Women Binge is distributed by Podcast Heat. For more information, visit podcastheat.com. Do you have a question or a comment or a topic you want to suggest for the show? Well, we are listening. Email us at wwbquestions at gmail.com. We'd love to hear from you.